Hello again. It's been a blustery end to the working week, unusually breezy for the middle of August. That breeze continues overnight, but the worst of the showers will ease and the wet weather across the northeast of Scotland will finally clear away. Further wet weather to come through Wales and then the Midlands and East Anglia through Friday evening and the early hours of Saturday. But eventually the showers much more scattered and mainly over towards northern and western coasts. The breeze will keep temperatures generally in the double figures, but some sheltered spots could dip into the single figures. Nevertheless, a bright start to Saturday. Plenty of sunshine for eastern Scotland, much of northeast England. Southern parts of England and Wales will stay largely dry with sunny spells into the afternoon, but there'll be further heavy downpours coming through into central and western Scotland, much of northern England and northern Ireland. And it'll be another breezy day. The breeze into the high 30s, low 40s in terms of the gustiness of that wind, and it's going to make it feel quite cool. Now, during Saturday evening, most of the showers and eventually the breeze will start to die away. And it's a dry, clear night for most of us under those clear skies. And with lighter winds, temperatures will drop away. So more widely, a fresh start to Sunday. Plenty of sunshine first thing under this brief ridge of high pressure. But it is only a brief ridge of high pressure. As we say goodbye to Friday's low, we say hello to Sunday's low. Now, this is the remnants of an ex-hurricane. But it sounds more scary than it will actually be. And for much of Scotland and much of northern and eastern England, no sign of any hurricane to come on Sunday. It's going to be a beautiful day, plenty of sunshine continuing into the afternoon. But for much of Wales, southwestern England, it will turn cloudy and it will turn particularly dull with a lot of low cloud and mistiness near the coast. Damp with outbreaks of light rain. But for Northern Ireland, that's where the heaviest rain will move in later in the afternoon, a particularly wet end of the day here. Again, feeling cool, not many places reaching 20 degrees, but at least in the north and east it will stay dry.